It's the most wonderful time of the year. It's Christmas time. This actually is like one of my favorite times of the year. So today we're gonna be decorating for Christmas. Right now, I obviously have no Christmas decor at all. And shout out to Juan and Charlie because they're letting me use the Christmas tree again because they don't have room for it in their apartment. So I don't have to buy one. I do have a need to get ornaments, lights, any Christmas decorations. I have one Christmas decor. Tiny little tree right here. So let's start decorating. I don't know if I'm gonna leave this here or not. I have a really good idea. Did you guys know that on Netflix, they literally have fireplace for your home? And this is all it is. That's literally perfect. Christmas vibes. I would play Christmas music, but no copyright. Christmas tree. I still don't understand how this thing fits in such a small box. Something that has been making me feel ready for the holidays is just being a little fancy, kind of having my nails done. Look at this. I am genuinely so upset. I've never loved my nails more than I do right now. And then this ring just really ties it together. And then I have this bracelet and these necklaces. And this is a green emerald necklace. It's literally perfect. And that brings us to today's sponsor, which is Ana Luisa. I've been wearing their jewelry for months now. It's literally my favorite jewelry I've ever had. Like. I'm wearing their necklace, I'm wearing their earrings, and I have a ring and a bracelet from them. And it's just so elegant, it just ties together everything so well. I can wear the most basic relaxed outfit like today, big t-shirt, and it adds such an elegance to it. So it's like a dress up or dress down situation, but it's also affordable. Their pieces start at $39 and then can go to the higher range, so there's something for everyone. And with the holidays coming up, I would definitely recommend honestly getting it for yourself or sister, mother, best friend, whoever, they will love. It. They offer quick delivery all around the world. Anna Luisa is also carbon neutral from their packaging to their products. And the best part is when I wear their jewelry, I feel like a woman, like an elegant, put together woman. Their jewelry has made me feel so confident and I'm not just saying this because it's sponsored. I will never take their jewelry off. I love it so much. I 10 out of 10 recommend Anna Luisa. So please make sure to click the link in the description, use code Cindy Francis for 20% off and go get yourself some nice, beautiful, elegant jewelry. It's been so long since I've even put together a Christmas tree. I'm literally already sweating. This looks like the top. This is the base. How can you tell? I can't tell which one looks bigger. Oh, this one has the really long bottom. So this is the base. Oh, I don't have any screws for the... I will have to make a trip to the store, but hopefully it'll just stay up by itself for now. Step one. Okay, go. Okay, go. No, I'm so confused right now. I think it does go like this. Okay, yeah. Then the top. I don't know why I thought this was gonna be the most challenging thing in the world. That was so easy. Now I have to do all the annoying work. Ta-da. <laughs> I'm debating if I should go get Christmas stuff right now or go tomorrow. Why do I feel like this fire is actually like warming me up? For Christmas, you. Executive decision has been made. We are gonna do a quick, and I mean quick, store run. I tried to go to Goodwill, there wasn't really anything, so now I'm just going to Walmart to get like lights and ornaments for the tree and see what I can find. I'm not trying to go too crazy this year. I don't wanna spend too much money. It's also freaking hot today. This sucks. I officially don't want to buy anything else. Okay, I think I got everything I need. I hope I'm finally done shopping for the holidays. So I think I'm gonna fluff the tree and then add the light. To add to the vibes, I'm gonna put on a little Christmas movie while I do it. So I got little screws to put in the bottom, but they weren't small enough. They're actually too big. So I'm hoping that she just stays up until I can get what fits. Lights are on. I'm so excited to plug it in and see how it looks. I got a little skirt for the tree. I love this like deep red color. So let's lay this down first. Well, actually I think I need to do that last. So let's just put the tree back there. Oh no, it like closed. This is why I need the screw. First of all, that's literally the perfect spot for the tree. Okay, let's put the skirt on. We don't fall on me. I love it, that's so cute. Put some of these branches further down. 
All right, who's ready to see the lights? Hopefully they're on there good enough. I can't find the plug-in. <gasps> it's so pretty! I honestly love it without even any ornaments yet, so I'm very excited to add the ornaments. Yay! My house just went from no Christmas vibes to all the Christmas vibes. I am very, very, very excited about the ornaments I bought. So I got a classic, but I'm hoping that I can mostly do these because I'm very excited. Black. I guess continuing with my haul, I got this garland. I was either thinking here, but it's honestly really long, so I could put it up on my shelf up there, but that's also hard to get to. I'm still deciding. And then I got this, which I figured Phoenix would play with, and then also it's just cute. I got me and my boyfriend both a stocking. I don't know where I'm gonna hang that. Like over there. I don't know. I gotta decide. For the tree topper, I decided to go with this because it's pretty subtle, it's like wooden, but it is an angel and it has like the little green stuff and I love that. I got some red garland, got some of these, and then also got these little pine cones which I can hang some on the tree and then put some throughout the house. So let's decorate. I just realized, I don't know if these come with the things, the like hooks that you're supposed to use to hang everything. Why would they not come with that? Hold on, I gotta dump these out. Yep, didn't come with any. And I remember looking at it in the store and was like, oh, I should probably get some of those. Then I forgot. Um, I made a couple DIYs out of twist ties. First ornament, so cute. Why would it not come with the strings? So I'm low-key thinking, put these up here. I think that works. I like that. Okay, that's Christmassy. I like the vibes. I did get some lights that I think I'll be able to add to it, but I'm afraid we won't be able to do the TV because this is where the button is. I guess I could just test it. Okay, you can still use it, so I might go with that. Oh my gosh! I love it! It's so magical. This is a moment of truth because my work just sent me this new microphone and I'm testing it out for the first time right now. So let me know how the audio sounds without it. So this is without the microphone. This is with the microphone. Does it sound a lot better? Plus it comes with two of them and I can hook them to my shirt with a magnet or clip. Anyway, let's continue decorating for Christmas. I feel like with this new mic, the possibilities are just endless because I can go really far away and you guys can still hear me perfectly fine. And I can turn away from the camera and you can still hear me. But the way um, uh -huh. The reason I came in here was because I need to put on my Christmas pajama pants if we are going to be filming Christmas stuff. Give me a moment so you guys can still hear me even though I'm literally in here taking off my pants. How's it going for y'all? Okay, who's ready for a reveal? Christmas pants. I feel like I should also put on like fuzzy socks or something. I actually don't know if I have any. I am searching. Oh, I do have some. Do these count as Christmas? I think these are my only fuzzy socks. Let's try them on. I've not worn fuzzy socks in I don't even know how long. Okay, I'm feeling a bit more Christmas. Um, also, I'm gonna do a haul of all the like Christmas things I've bought, but this was Phoenix's Christmas present. Basically, this is what we were dealing with. It looks really bad because Phoenix keeps climbing in it and I can't really get him to stop, so everything's like all droopy now. I think we should do an interview with Phoenix about this situation. Phoenix, can you come here? Phoenix. We have some questions. Phoenix, why did you climb into the Christmas tree? Good answer. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Okay. Finally, an important piece to putting together the Christmas tree is little things to hang the ornaments. My motivation from the first day that we did this to now has gone significantly down especially because it is sunlight out and I feel like it needs to be dark so I can get the Christmas tree lights vibes going. This tree just looks so sad. We're gonna pep her up a bit. Peppa Pig! Not sure why I just said that. Actually, I think the culprit might be the fact that I didn't fluff one of the sides because this used to be the front. If I had to spin it to get Phoenix out. I'm not good at this. All right, let's just put some ornaments on and hopefully it'll start to look better. These are all stuck together, how annoying. Um, there's a big side and a little side and I don't know how this works. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. Hang, woohoo! There's one of a million, you're one in a million. Name that song. Now I really wanna watch Hannah Montana. Is Hannah Montana on? <gasps> Is it on Disney Plus? Wait. I think I need to check right now. So it actually is on here, but I can't decide if I should just watch Hannah Montana or if I should watch the Hannah Montana movie. Cause the movie's so good. Like some of my favorite songs come from the movie. So I think we'll go with it. Not very Christmas, but it kind of is. Cause it's like hometown roots, family, you know.
So I'm pretty much completely decorated for Christmas. Nothing too crazy, just the stockings and the tree and like, I forgot what that thing is called that's on the TV stand thing. Oh, garland. But I wanted to show you some of the things that I bought for like Black Friday as a Christmas present to myself. First things first is this new bag. It is my new Bible bag and it can go like over the shoulder or I can just hold it. And it's the best tote bag I've ever had because it's more of like a square. And then there's like an extra pocket so I can just put stuff right there and not have to like dig down into my bag to get like my keys out. At church on Sundays, I gotta put my Bible, I gotta put my notebook, my pencil bag, like all that stuff. Speaking of new pencil bag, so cute. Kind of matches the vibe of the tote bag. Like we're going different shades of kind of the same, I guess they're just neutrals. It's not really the same color. And so far all of this is off of Amazon. I got new highlighters. And now for my favorite thing that I got, I finally went ahead and upgraded to a new Bible. This Bible is from Etsy. I got a lot of questions about where it's from when I posted it on Instagram. So I, if I remember, we'll link it in the description. And then this is what the inside looks like. It's one of those Bibles where you can like write notes inside. And look how cute the writing in it is. So when it switches to like a new book exodus the old testament super cute writing also i'm doing laundry upstairs so if it sounds weird it's the laundry and i started using it with my highlighters and it doesn't seem to bleed too bad i highlighted this page in galatians which is what i'm reading right now and this is the back side so i think it's fine I was a little worried about the new highlighters, but I think it's working out pretty good. Then I got these, which I thought would be fun to film myself putting them on. I'm gonna do this, and then I have a few more things to show you guys of stuff that I got. Hello, this video has now been over the course of multiple days by accident. The other fun Christmas things I got were a bunch of candles at Bath and Body Works. I went to their sale where it was like $10 for the three wick candles and I actually got five candles. I don't know if I regret spending that much money on candles, but also I will be using them. I know we're already like almost at Christmas, but can we talk about how fast Christmas has come? Like already this weekend, we'll be driving down to see his family. I fly out from there next Thursday. That is so soon. And then Christmas is that Sunday. We are two weeks approximately, I guess technically three from the day of families from Christmas. Like how did it come so soon? That's pretty much it for this video. Oh, should I show you guys the final of the it's just so simple like it's really not much but it's enough for the christmas spirit and i just love the way it looks at night with the christmas tree on anyway that's gonna be it for today's video once again thank you to ana luisa for sponsoring definitely go check them out link in the description i love their stuff love you guys bye